I work on all kinds of armor. I will do my best to make you strong and secure. This will protect you. We could use the old road from Omi up through Fort Camino Dake. Only problem is it's held by Mongols. We need help to drive them out. I know some hunters camped on Mount Sago. Their leader's named Takashi. Friend of yours? No, but he'll do anything I ask, and his men are good archers. While you're meeting them, I'll slip through your uncle's castle. Meet our friends in Omi. Lead them to strike the fort from the south. I'll attack from the north with your hunter friends. You think it'll work? Yes. Be careful, you know. You too. You're welcome at our campfire, my lord. Are you Takeshi? You know my name? I'm Jin Sakai. Yuna sent me. She's alive? Where is she? The Mongols blocked the pass to Omi. I have to open the way and I can't do it alone. Yuna told me you can help. <laughs> Sounds dangerous. I thought you were an expert hunter. Leader of the best archers in the prefecture. Is that what Yuna told you? She thinks you care enough to fight. Is she wrong? About me? No. But my people need a reason to risk their lives. It's going to be a cold winter. Why spend it on a mountainside hunting squirrel when you can live in a warm fort? If we can stay till spring, we're in. You have a deal. This won't be like hunting wild boar. Come over here and you'll see. Mongol archers guard the gate. Patrols ride in and out all day. If we can get in from this side, Yuna and the rest of my friends will hit them from the south. You know we'll be there? All right. The fort was built around the cliffs. We can use them to get inside. Woodcutter camp. Supplied lumber to the fort. Haven't seen anyone there since the Mongols showed up. How good are you at climbing? Better than average.
up here much longer, the Mongols are sure to see us. Back away from the edge. I'll be right up. <laughs> sure you will. Yuna's got some interesting friends. Let's plan our attack. We can see inside from over here. We'll get on that roof. Control the high ground. <laughs> you sound like Yuna. She was a good teacher. <laughs> Archers on that ridge will have a good view of the courtyard. And plenty of targets. The bulk of our force should go there. You men with me. Everyone else get to the ridge. If the enemy sees me, take them down. Understood. Good luck. Stand and fight me! She is a bad guy in the Kill every bastard in this fort. Another patrol. We'll ambush them when they come through. Hide. You heard him. Move. Open fire on my signal. Let them get closer. Now, shoot them all! Ready! Shoot them! What's up? What's up? Come on, everyone. Let's get to the bridge. I heard Lord Shimura has an army with samurai from the Shogun. Why aren't you leading them? Lord Shimura has his plan to fight the Mongols. I have mine. You're on your own. This fort isn't yours to give us. The Jito is at his castle. He'll have no need of this place until spring. That came from the southern gate. Got to see what's happening. Over here. You know. She did that. We have to get over there. Let's get a look at the bridge. The Mongols sent most of the forces over there. This is our chance. If we charge across the bridge, we'll have to deal with that watcher quickly. Could you sneak under the bridge with that hook of yours? Take the watch by surprise? I could grapple onto the tree and swing across. There's a way up the cliff on the other side. If they spot you, we can hit them with arrows. Charge across or sneak over. Either way, it'll be risky. We'll follow your lead, Lord Sakai. Get your people ready to move.
There they are. And they brought some friends from Yarikawa. I figured it out. You're the ghost, but you're supposed to be ten feet tall. You finally got here. Don't get too close. They'll see me. I'm trying to get away. You should have waited for us to open the gate. It was Matako's idea. Sakai, we're just in time. Keep swinging, Kuryu. What is ours, my lord? Is everyone all right? Never better. All things considered. Good to see you, Lord Sakai. Uh, um, is it this cold everywhere up here? You'll get used to it. Take any supplies we need and prepare to ride for Jogaku. So, you and Takeshi... That was my old life. He and his people are more than hunters, aren't they? Depends on how you look at it. I told them they can stay and hold the pass for us. But I don't want bandits making trouble for innocent people fleeing the Mongols. He knows what I'd do to him if they tried. I think he's been looking forward to seeing you. He's seen me. We can go now. Let's get everyone to Jokaku. We'll plan our final attack from there. It's time for the Khan to die. to have some extra hands around here. How are the others? Ready to follow wherever you lead. The sensei told them you're the only person on Tsushima who can kill the Khan. I can't do it alone. Or without a plan of attack. And we know he's at Port Izmi, surrounded by an army. We need to know the weakness in their defense. How to get past them. And where to find the Khan. Sounds like we need a hawk's view of the place. I know where we can get one. We'll have cover of darkness if we leave now. Port Izmi. We'll have a better view from the lighthouse. Just need to get up there. Without being noticed. Let's move.
Why would the Khan come up here? He'll sail for our mainland. Attack it, just like you did here. This is our last chance to stop him. These flowers? The same ones I used to make my poison. The Mongols have been here picking them. To use against us. Did we do the right thing at your uncle's castle? I took a risk, and my poison saved thousands. What if it kills thousands more? We have to stop the Khan before it comes to that. You're right. We need to kill him. Soon. We can't get in the front, but we could climb around the cliff. And sneak in through the back. Lead the way. What's in all these barrels? Supplies? Flowers. Poison. One barrel holds enough to kill hundreds. The Khan will use this against the mainland. We can't let him leave Tsushima. We'll scout Port Izumi from the top of the lighthouse. Right behind you. you see before a storm that could work to our advantage for now I'll leave the lighthouse dark make sure the Mongols can't use it when the storm hits we can relight it once they're gone let's get a look at the port over here let's find our plan of attack the harbor master's estate the Khan may have taken it for himself close to the docks and his fleet makes sense See how the birds are circling? Like they're scared of something on its way. The storm, preparing to fly inland for shelter. We could place archers there. Force the Mongols to fight uphill? Ah, uh, Cotton would send horsemen to outflank us. The Mongols left that area empty. Too open, can't defend it. But a good place for an ambush. That ridge has an open sightline to the Mongol fleet. Imagine what we could do to their ships if we had our own watchers. The Khan is almost ready to sail for our mainland. With ships full of men, explosives, and my poison. If we don't stop him here, the Shogunate will fall. The storm is our key to beating him. When it comes, the Khan will have to shelter his fleet in the bay. That's when we strike. Destroy his ships and everything on them. To do this, we'll need Mongol weapons. A simple task for a master thief. <laughs> we'll need fighters, too. A small force could distract the Mongols while I get inside Port Izmi and kill the Khan. It could work. Let's get back to Jokaku and prepare.
Jin. I'm sorry to interrupt. You're not. Praying. To my ancestors. Asking forgiveness for what I'm about to do. What do they say? I can't hear them. Perhaps your ancestors are silent because they can't do what you must. I know where my sister is. Clan Kikuchi's old fort. Then you're ready? I have no incense left to burn. No more prayers to make. The Kikuchi estate is this way. How did you find your sister? She was married to a man named Ikeda, a retainer for Clan Kikuchi. Their stronghold is near here, under the mountain. She always wanted an estate and holdings of her own. And with Kikuchi's men fallen at Komoda. It made sense she would try and take Kikuchi's for herself. Especially after she failed to take yours. I asked around. It seems a new clan has taken up residence. Their emblem matches the one on the notes. Then it's her. People say she's turned it into a haven for refugees. Claiming she knows what it's like to lose her home. Do you think it's true? We're about to find out. Why would your sister say she lost her home? She had to leave home when she married Ikeda. You said Ikeda was a retainer? Yes. But you're the younger sister. Why were you the one to marry a samurai? When we were young, bandits attacked our estate. Hana hid with our parents. I took up a sword. Only after I dispatched the bandits did a samurai guard arrive to help. Adachi was leading them. Hana saw him as a way to realize her ambitions, but he only had eyes for me. She was jealous then, the seed of many betrayals. I wanted to ease her heartbreak, so I helped arrange her marriage to Ikeda, and she was sent north. Did you know the man you sent your sister to live with? Ikeda was a respected widower. People spoke well of his kindness. Kindness is a mask, easily removed behind closed doors. What are you getting at, Jin? I want to understand why she went to such extremes to destroy you. After so many years. There is only one thing to understand. Hana murdered my family. And today, she will pay for it. Was there ever any sign of her betrayal? We were never close, but our relationship was always cordial. I would see her at Lord Shimura's conclaves. We'd exchange pleasantries. I had no idea she held such hate in her heart. But she was at your estate, the day of the attack. She came that morning, to wait with me for news from Komoda Beach. We were both concerned for our husbands. It was the first time I ever felt close to her. She met my grandchildren brought them gifts. They loved her. Now I know she hadn't come for comfort, but to witness our deaths. The women in your family fought. I saw that for myself. I stayed with my son's wives while Hana took the children and ran for the stables. Afterward, I found what I thought was her body. The face was brutalized, unrecognizable. But the gold sash was Hana's. I buried her with my family. She must have learned you survived the attack. Faked her death to escape you. A clever plan. My survival was her greatest mistake. We're almost there. Leave the horses. We'll continue on foot.
Guards at the gate. Be ready. If this is a haven for survivors, there's no time for this. Where is Lady Hana? It's Lady Massacre! Kill her! Cut them down! Open the gate. Quickly, before more guards show up. <sighs> so she is helping people. Hana helps no one but herself. Lady Hana, show yourself! Kill them! Yes, where is she? Reinforcements. You serve a murderer. Miss me, you coward! Yes. Push toward the dojo! How many are there? Doesn't matter. Kill them all. I've had enough! Kill them and let's be done with it! This ends here! Cause it! Where's Lady Hana? In the estate up the hill, my lord. Tell the coward her sister has come. What will you do when you see her? Exactly what she did to me. She's still your family. My family is dead. She is nothing but a murderer. Hana, show yourself. Little sister. You let me think I buried you. Who was it, really? A peasant woman killed by the Mongols. Did you weep for me? You have taken everything! Daughters and grandchildren. Not nearly enough. The Mongols robbed me of Adachi's death. And you cheated yours. But finally, I will take everything. Kill them. Stop her. I will deal with them. Thank you. You murdered my children. My grandchildren. Destroyed my family. A small price to pay for what you've done. I have done nothing. You stole everything. Drove me from our home. Took the life that was rightfully mine. Left me with that abusive drunk in this frozen land. To suffer an eternity of pain to understand the life I've lived. The life you forced on me. None of that is my fault. It is. And 
damn you for acting as if it isn't. You've come to kill me, so finish this. It will be your only kindness. I can't end your suffering, but you can. Now, you have nothing! I never mourned my family. I've tried to honor them. Meditate on treasured memories. But she consumes them. Even now. I have nothing left. No. You've accomplished what you set out to do. You have honored your family. Given them justice. Now you can find peace. This path does not lead to peace. Where does it lead? I don't know. I have to continue walking it to find out. I don't want you to go. I must. But I will be there when you need me. your age. People said I was the next Tadayori Nagao. The best archer we've ever had. Eh, not even close. But I'm damn good. And I'm grateful for everything you taught me. I was so dedicated to my study. I never made time for a family. Tomoe was to be my heir. Her crimes... I could not forgive her. No samurai would. I devoted my life to the bow. The life it gave me was remarkable. But the life... it took from me. Family is more important. Sensei? Don't become like me. Don't let the ghost consume you. Hey. Tomoe is somewhere in Kamiyagata. A last-ditch effort to rally the Mongols and restore her reputation. If she's here, we will find her. And end this. Yes, we will.
Japanese arrows. Lord Shimura's men? Japanese archers did this. Likely a group. Unless Sensei Ishikawa has been here. <gasps> Good idea to sneak up on me. I thought you were with the man who killed these Mongols. He was samurai, but older. An archer? Sensei Ishikawa. Where is he? He said he'd come back to my house in a day or two. Why your house? I have food, a fire. Whatever his business was, it seemed urgent. It's possible he picked up Tomoe's trail. Where's your house? Not far, but there's a storm coming, and I need to check my snares first. Then I can take you there. Fine, I'll go with you. What's your name? Matsu, my lord. What exactly did Sensei Ishikawa tell you? Nothing more, my lord. He wasn't the friendliest man. Sounds about right. I never talked to a real samurai. War brings unlikely people together. It's my chance to ask a really good question. Don't mess it up. <laughs> What's it like to hold the power of life and death in your hands? It's a heavy responsibility. But you secretly enjoy it. Only a monster would enjoy it. That's not the answer I expected. There! One of my snares. Check it quickly. I don't want to miss Ishikawa. Damn. Empty. Have to reset it. You might have more luck hunting. Oh, I could never do that. So awful. Maybe try a different bait. My bait never changes. What do you use? The illusion of opportunity. There's your problem. That only works on men. <laughs> this way, my lord. It's not easy surviving up here. It's hard everywhere. I fled north when the Mongols came. Alone? My parents died when I was a girl. Been on my own ever since. Your family must be very important. My uncle is Lord Shimura. Wait! You're the one people talk about. The ghost. <sighs> but you're not ten feet tall with eyes like a demon. No. But the stories frighten the enemy. So that's it? It's just rumors and exaggeration? <sighs> to fight them, I've had to do things I would have frowned on before. We all have. My catch! Drive them off, my lord! Please! Wait here. Uh, they're starving. Hey! Please don't hurt us, my lord! That's not yours. We are sorry. It's just a squirrel. We have eaten grass and tree bark for days. Take it and go. Thank you, my lord. You let them escape! We thought dinner! They were starving. And no threat. Doesn't sound like the ghost I've heard about. Not all the stories about me are true. The blizzard is almost on us. How many more traps do you have? Just one. But it's farther away.
What's it like to be the ghost? It's not easy, but I wouldn't change it. No doubts or regrets? Plenty. But I'll do anything to drive the invaders from our home. We should get back soon. I don't want to miss Sensei Ishikawa. The last trap is just a little farther, my lord. Here we are. Hope we don't go hungry. Look at this! Dinner! You got something? We might eat like civilized people after all. What's up there? The mainland. No Mongols, no war. Somewhere I can start over. Say you make it to the mainland. What then? In Kyoto, I'll open a fancy inn. Learn to play the shamisen. Welcome the undying parade of beautiful men and women. While my servants rob them blind. Sounds like Kyoto's in trouble. It's snowing harder. We should go. Maybe your sensor will be waiting for us. Weather's getting worse. Stay close. If I get any closer, we'll have to share a horse. What was that? Never mind. Keep going. To the house. I'll deal with him. Stay back. Where's your house? Not far. Come on. Here we are. Let's get inside. You seem too kind to be the ghost. But the way you killed those Mongols... I do what I have to for Tsushima. The truth is, we're both survivors. We have darkness in us. If we didn't, we'd be dead. Sensei Shikawa said something similar. But it sounds more natural coming from you, Tomoe. Ishikawa always said I underestimate my opponents. I don't have an arrow in my back. Why not? The Mongols turned against me. After you trained them to slaughter our people. A mistake I tried to fix. But I can't kill all my archers. Not our own. You need me. And the sensei. But we don't need you. I know where they'll attack next. We can ambush them together. You get a victory, I get revenge. I'll talk it over with Sensei Shikawa. Jing. You can stay the night. 
No, Tomoe. I can't. Sakai. Sakai, you have news. Something like that. Against her. If you saw her, why is she still alive? Her archers are preparing a massive attack. She wants the three of us to wipe them out. Or she needs both our heads to get back in the Mongols' favor. She could have killed me, Sensei, but she didn't. <laughs> I have never been rewarded for trusting Tomoe. I don't trust her. But we need what she knows. And I believe she needs our help. Then she's a fool. And we finish this. <laughs> 